I'm Dan Nelson, I'm from Warfield, Nebraska. I farm with my uncle. Half of it's irrigated, half of it's dry land. On the wheat, we've been using, I believe it's the 342C, the chloride program that you guys have. I've uh, been using that. Uh, coldering it on in the fall, half of it, and the other half I top dress with a herbicide in the spring. We put a little XR in on some wheat last year. That was our first year trying it. And, and we put some fungicide on with it. Didn't really leave a test out there, but it, it was pretty darn good wheat. The wheat prices were looking good, and, and we were putting that fungicide out out there, and we, we wanted to, they recommend using the XRN as a, a kind of an adhesive for that fungicide to stick it to the plant. And so we tried it out. We, we've used XRN on corn and find, found its benefits, so we just figured it'd work on wheat too. I noticed the drought tolerance went up. A healthier plant that they, they really tolerated, and I mean, there was a yield increase, but you know, maybe five, six bushel, which at $12 is, is damn well worth it. But I noticed the plant health was, was extremely better. And we did put XRN on there, and I noticed it did stimulate more pod development. I think I just put one gallon of XRN and one pint of uh, Micromax on that, and it really did show. The plant was healthier. On the corn, this year was the first year, we, we actually mixed Micromax in with it too. Right prior to canopy, I put my final application of Roundup on and then put the two gallons of XRN on. And then I think I used a pint of Micromax, I believe. Uh, worked real well. We did a test strip this year and, and noticed a, you know anywhere from 10 to 30 bushel difference in yield. Your heavier soils, we didn't notice as much a difference in, but the lighter soils really, really showed a difference in them. Yeah, I apply it with my own sprayer. I just hook it up to the sprayer and re, you know set the meter at zero and pump 200 gallons on and, and adjust my rates accordingly. Put two gallons an acre on it. It works real slick, really. I haven't had any trouble. You know, I've used some competitors' products. They salt out bad. I've never had trouble with Kugler. I've never had trouble with it really plugging filters or anything. It's, it's real good stuff, real good clean product. You know, we're usually drier than, than what the round rain we got this year, and we were able to utilize you know, more water to grow more bushels, and we needed more nitrogen out there for it, and, and we applied it. I think you know, we succeeded to get a higher yield because we were able to go in with a mid-season boost there with the nitrogen. I think it's worth it. I'm gonna go with XRN again next year.